morning. This is Mickey Sunshine Creates and I'm Mickey and I've got an unboxing for you. Um, hope you didn't see that. I might have to blur it out when I edit. <laughs> this is a Diamond Art Club that I just recently got. Uh, I've been waiting a long time for this particular painting to come back and it finally came back so I can get it. Um, I'm in love with this artist. I think I just, I just love his, his paintings are so whimsical and I love them. Um, this is a square uh, as shown by the, the purple square and the fact that it says square diamonds on it. You know, the, yeah, if it were round, it would have a round thing here and it would be pink. Um, but this is, it, it comes in a bigger box, um, wrapped in, it's shrink wrapped. But I've already opened this, <laughs> and my, I don't know what happened to my recording. I, I, I don't know where it is. I can't find it. <laughs> I found it because uh, I updated my software, and it changed the, the output fo folder, and I finally found it, and I thought I found it, and I thought I moved it to the cloud where I wanted it, and mm, it was, it's gone. <laughs> so we're trying this one more time yay okay so it comes in shrink wrap which i've already taken off and i'm going to open it up well on the back it's got one two three four five six steps on how done painting works and a list of your kit contents there is you have everything in here that you need to start and finish your painting. It's it's nice. It, 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 you've got everything. All right, let's take this out. All right, and it comes wrapped in its own wrapper. Another wrapper. There's also a toolkit, which I had taken out and put back. The toolkit has. Let's take a look at what the toolkit has. Yay! Okay, we have a tray with a stopper, so that you know I. I don't use these, so whatever. Uh, a pen with a squishy to put on it so that it's not so rough on your hands. <laughs> a really sharp tweezers. I mean, these, these suckers are really sharp, and I have stabbed myself before, so be careful, please. Uh, two slabs of heart-shaped wax. Don't forget to peel off the top, and there's... Two of them in here, uh, but don't forget to peel off the, the plastic before you stick your uh, pen in there. Okay, we have looks like it's a four placer and it's a thin four placer. And this, is, there we go. See how thin that is. And we have a seven placer, thin also, which is another good thing. Um, I like multi-placing. And last but not least, you have a packet of uh, baggies, Ziplocs, zippers, whatever, for storage. Um, if you want to work, you can work directly out of baggies, which a lot of people do. Um, or you can work out of something else. I will show you in a minute uh, what it is that you can work out of. That's so cool. That makes it easy, whether you're working out of baggies or boxes. And that is this. Uh, but I don't want to show it to you yet. <laughs> I don't want to show you the picture yet. So we'll go over that in a little bit. I'm going to show you the picture right now. Here's the bag. Here come the drills. Oh, look at these drills. Aren't they pretty? All right, I'm going to do everything I can to get rid of the glare. Because all I have out here is my window. I don't have any lights on. But this painting is by Gary Patterson. And I don't know if you've ever bought checks from, I don't know, Checks R Us or whatever those, those companies are. But... They have uh, uh, cartoons and, and paintings and things that you can put on the checks. I've always gone 
for the Gary Patterson because they're just so cute and they, they, they're nice. They fade nicely into the background. I am sorry about the focusing and unfocusing. This camera is driving me wild. Let's see if I can get it set. Here we go. Cat now. <laughs> Isn't that adorable? Look at the, the fishies and the little mice. And why is it called cat nap? Because we have a cat who's napping. <laughs> now, I'm crazy about cats. So, having been crazy about Gary Patterson, look at this. I mean, it's, I don't usually do cartoony uh, pictures, but it, there's something about this. I mean, look, he's a little mouse, <laughs> and there's a ball that he was playing with, and he fell asleep in the middle of playing, and I don't know what that is, but it looks like it's a real mouse peeking over <laughs> the quilt there. I just, I think it's adorable. I do. I just think this is adorable. Look at that. Anyway, the canvas is very soft. So you don't have to roll it or anything. It'll just, it'll start laying flat by itself. Uh, on the bottom here is the uh, name of the painting, the size. It's 56 by 71 centimeters. Uh, it's by Gary Patterson. Uh, and Diamond Art Club, and this here, here's all information. Um, you can take a, a discount on your next purchase. Uh, and it comes with a lifetime warranty and a free missing diamonds protection. So if you are missing diamonds or you spill yours, give them a, a note. Give, you know, you don't have to call them up. Just give them a note through... Uh, messenger or wherever and tell them what you need the size the shape and how many and they're, they're more than happy to send it to you you know i i had some problems and they just sent them right out uh I, i've been in love with this now uh, here's what i was so excited about well first let me you have on the upper left you have the symbol chart down here now, the symbol chart shows you the various symbols and their DMC color numbers on the side. I, uh, uh, sorry about the glare. Uh, and the, the symbols on here are very large, which is nice. They're easy to see. They're a little tinier here. <laughs> so you may need magnifiers if you're, if you got old eyes like me. Uh, and there's another symbol chart on the lower right. So you've got it, if you turn it upside down, or you're working, however you're working, you've got this. But best of all, you have this. This is a sticker that you can stick into a notebook. You can cut it and just keep the picture if you want. You can, it, it has the start and end date if you want to keep track of that. It's got all the information on the shape, uh, the size, skew, so if you have any problems, uh, you can call. But best of all, these are labels that you can peel off and you can stick onto your baggies, if that's what you're using, or another storage container such as Harbor Freight, which is what I use. They've got little boxes, and I use each little box for different colors. And I just peel it off and stick it on. There's also Elizabeth Ward um, storage boxes. There's uh, Art Dot has these cool uh, round containers in a nice fabric case. So you can take it with you <laughs> if you want. Um, but either way, no matter what, you have the advantage of these labels. And like I said, the letters and numbers and, and whatever they are, are very clear, very big. So they're easy to see, you know, if you've got it out. Now, this one has 32 colors and four ABs. Now, AB stands for Aurora Borealis. And like the Northern Lights, it's coated with an iridescent coating so that it, it shimmers and shines it, it, blue and green and pink and yellow and all these different colors 
because of the iridescent coating, it, it's, we call it blinging. <laughs> It's, it's bling, and it's really pretty, and I, I love it. <laughs> I'm getting, I, I used to resist, I used to resist and only use what they gave you in your kits. Uh, now, I'm afraid I have uh, an obsession with ABs, and I have a lot. <laughs> and the thing is, they're all square. I mean, let me give you a quick glance at the height of, of ridiculousness. One, two, three, four, five boxes of this. I just, I know I'm terrible. It's, I'm just, ah, there's no hope for me. I'm just completely hopeless. <laughs> Oh, but I'm funny. At least I keep them. I amuse myself. Anyway, uh, I'm going to turn this over and I'm going to show you the drills. Uh, in the meantime, while you're waiting, uh, which is not going to be for long, subscribe. Become a subscriber. Donate. Uh, all the information is down below. Plus, there's information about the upcoming Great Escape event, which this year is Fantasy. So any fantasy landscape or any fantasy place that you would like to escape to, not a person, not a mermaid or a fairy or a unicorn, but to an actual place. They're the forest, the, a house that's kind of wonky, uh, castles, a planet with two moons, whatever. Someplace fantastical. Um, all the information is down below in the description. So I'll just click on the more and read it all and how you apply what you do and it, it's we start august 1st so i'm giving we're giving you plenty of time and do take a look at some of the um the live i have one live there that i did with uh rebecca who is my co-host and uh rose prophet who is our special sponsor who created a couple a few diamond paintings for us. Rebecca and I are going to do the same one. I think it's called Fairy Town or something like that. Uh, but she did 12. <laughs> we only asked for four. She did 12. And there is a 10% discount, so take advantage of that. Um, and join us. Anyway, um, think about it, and I'll be right back. And I'm back. We're, I'm going to give a crackle alert because if you're wearing headphones, this, this may be a little loud. All right, I just have to find out where I placed. Oh, there we go. That was easy. Oh, I see. What the? Yeah. Ah, oh, I see. I got it. I put it on wrong. And I put it back. But at least I got it back. Hey. Alright, this is going to be a little messy. But I'm going to... And it might be a little long. These are called trains. And this is how a lot of uh, suppliers give their, you know... Give you their, their diamonds. Their, you know, their drills. Uh, we call them drills. Uh, and... Some use baggies, uh, you know, individual baggies, which is by weight. This is usually by number, by amount. Um, but you usually have enough, more than enough. And uh, frankly, I prefer the trains. I'd rather, because I use different storage bags. When they come in the baggies, you could just label them and use them right out of the baggies. Yeah. But I, I don't like baggies. I don't know why. Don't ask me. Maybe another time I'll tell you. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we have this beautiful chocolate brown. Oh, is that a chocolate brown? 939. And we have a very pretty cream color, 3770. This is a nice cream. Oh, look at that. Four of those? Five of those. Wow. Oh, a lot of cream. There's a lot of uh, color blocking in this, in this picture. I'm not nuts about color blocking. I prefer confetti. Where you change 
colors often in a small space. Um, I don't know why. I just, I get a kick out of it. <laughs> Color blocking I find a little boring, you know. It's just, you know, whatever. Uh, 3817, a very pretty sage green. Actually, it's closer to a mint green. Uh, 3024, there's two of them. Nice gray. Are these the same color? Yeah, these are the same. Amazing how they change when the light, the way the light strikes them. Okay, uh, 3814, a uh, really nice dark teal. I'm not pretty. Oh, AB! Now, uh, DAC always numbers their, their ABs uh, not according to DMC number, which is a shame because it would make it easier for uh, many of us, but according to their own numbering system, which is any number below 115, 159 or 154. Well, any number below 150 is going to be an AB. So uh, this is 101, and I don't know, can you see the color, the blues and greens that come in to this as they wiggle? You can see here, it still sparkles, but it's not sparkling color. You know, I, it's the iridescent coating makes a difference. So there's two of these, 101. Uh, purple. <clears throat> I love purple. 208. Another AB. Here's, this is 141, I could tell you. Right, without even looking, because 141 is their white. <laughs> but look how they look. And look at the sparkle, the bling. Oh, they even have, there are crystal ABs, too. Uh, if you ever get a chance to find them, go to uh, go to my my co-hosts. Go to Rebecca's channel, uh, Crafting and Crime Daily, and take a look at the bottom in her description of any one of her videos, and you'll find a link for DiamondPaintingDrills.com. And I do believe there's a, uh, a coupon for ten percent off. Also, I'm not sure. I don't remember, but. Give them a try. Take, take a look. Alyssa's got a beautiful collection. There are others. There's uh, Tima from Diamond Diamond Painting with Sparklers. DP with Sparklers. Dot com. And there's uh, DiamondPaintingUSA.com. Also, really nice. So we got the gray. Another gray. 415 and a yellow. Ooh, I like that. That's a... That's a, a, a dark buttery yellow. Almost like melted butter. <laughs> 7.44. Let's go on to the next tray. There's only three in here. So that's not going to be too bad. Here's a small one and upside down. So let's put that in. Okay, it's not a small one. <laughs> Another gray, 7.62. Oh, there's a number of gray in here. This is a light gray. Another yellow. This is more buttery yellow. 744. Oh, gosh. Look at that. It's the same. Oh, they're separating them now, making things difficult for me. 993, <laughs> which is uh, dark mint green, maybe, I guess. Uh, here's a very nice tan, light tan, 739. Very nice. Another yellow, 743. This is a bright yellow. Ooh, this is bright. Cheery. More gray, 775. Actually, this is baby blue. At first glance, it looks gray, but it's baby blue. This is pretty. This is 775. A uh, nice tan color. 437. Mm -hmm. I, I, I love colors. Um, darker baby blue. 3841. I love it. What can I say? I love these things. A uh, nice dark tan. A couple of them. There's 435 and 434. Nice browns. Dark, you know, medium. Light brown and a medium brown. Now, chocolate brown. 
another AB. <laughs> beep, beep. <laughs> this is 131, and this is a nice orange. I'm sorry, I, yeah, I obsess over sparkles. <laughs> over, over the twinkling it does. It also tends to reflect off the other uh, drills around it, so it gives a little extra. This is a <clears throat> delicious dark brown dark chocolate. I want this. This is this is a dark semi chocolate. <laughs> this is uh, this looks like a dust blue. Three three four. Okay. This is like a light forest green, 987, or a, a dark brass green. It looks like leaves. 318, a dark gray. <coughs> 332, <coughs> excuse me, another light blue. I'm not sure where I call that. It's a blue. It's just a blue. And last but not least, we have what I call the tiny train. This is where you don't have a lot of these. So, uh, 948 are really, that's a, that's, that's a nice antique cream. I would call that. Uh, a lavender purple, 316. I think that's a lavender purple. Yeah. Red, 900. Nice little orangey red, not not the six 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 red, but nine seven ninety eight. Another beautiful <clears throat> royal blue. Maybe? It's, it's it's a nice blue. Another green nine eighty nine. Oh, uh, well, pretty like it. This is grass green. It's like the grass. We've got three fifty six. And oh look look, there's we have we have a hitchhiker. And the hitchhiker is an AB. Ooh. He was a really ambitious little sucker. <laughs> <coughs> to pop in there with all those beautiful little rusty oranges. And here's the, another AB. In fact, that's... <coughs> he came from here and went into there and, you know, it, it's cheating. But he's got all the girls now. Uh, this is a beautiful 136. It's a, a dark purple blue, AB. Look at that sparkle. I'm sorry, yes, sparkle. Uh, dark gray. All right, char very charcoal gray. Uh, even darker gray. You know, this is burnt charcoal. <laughs> And another orange, and it looks like one of the grays popped in there, too. Look at that. We got another hitchhiker. There. But this is pretty. This is like a coral. Really nice. Um, oh, these are really pretty. I am... They just, the squares, I have to say, are in pretty good shape. I What you look, what you want to look for is edges that have a little nubby on them or the square is misshapen or there's a hole in the top which sometimes happens you know a little air pop it um usually DAC does not have a lot of what we call trash drills but I uh, not all of these drills are going to fit exactly in the squares some will, some will be a little smaller, you know, just a little tiny bit. But you can still line them up beautifully, so don't worry about it. I'm obsessed. You don't have to be. <laughs> I have I have a little bit of uh, OCD in, in, in when I do these. But I'm going to, um, yes, I'm, I am. I'm, <laughs> I'm going to pause this, and I will be right back to say goodbye and the last thing I forgot to show you is it comes with a sticker there you go that you can place on the outside of the box now I put mine on the top because I store my boxes horizontally no I store them vertically oh gosh yeah it's Friday what do you expect 
Um, some people sort that store them uh, horizontally, and they'll put it, you know, on the sides and then stack them up. You know, it's easy. You know, there's also a picture on the front, so that helps. So you know exactly what's inside and don't have to keep opening it up and guess. Uh, anyway, I want to thank you for coming and taking a look at this unboxing. I hope I showed you something that maybe you didn't know or you probably knew already, but yeah, a refresher course <laughs> on what's inside the Diamond Art Club boxes. Now, I got this one. Um, like I said, I, I told you earlier I was waiting for it, but the best thing about it was that I had a $50 gift certificate from the points I'd earned and saved. Uh, and this was only $54.99. So it cost me $4.99 plus shipping, which is a standard $10. Bucks. Uh, it, I, I, mean, I love this. I loved Diamond Arco has some really nice paintings. And they just came out with 40 more. Oh, God. I'm in, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble because I want more. But in, in the meantime, uh, and until the next, <laughs> just in the meantime, be good, be kind, be nice, be wonderful, be safe. Do what you have to do to keep yourself and others safe, please. Uh, and in, 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 until the next time, <laughs> I do get out